Oh me. Oh my. What are we gonna do? Eat this butterfly. Give it a thumbs up, bruh. Let's get it over 500 likes, bruh. All right. Hmm. Can you call Peter for butterfly abuse? I wonder. But that's not what this video is about. Bruh. We got a couple of dope Nintendo Switch news items. But the first one. It seems like the Switch is doomed. Forget the fact that it's the best-selling console of 2019. It's doomed. Forget the fact that it's crushing the competition month after month. It's doomed. It looks like we're getting every single Doom game ever made coming to the Switch. The latest is Doom 64. It looks like Doom 64 will be coming to the Switch. A listing has been spotted for the PC and PlayStation 4 versions of this game. But just like... The three, the classic trilogy that was just surprise launched on the Switch yesterday. Those three games were also just listed for the PlayStation 4 and PC. So, we it would be crazy for Bethesda to launch Doom 64 and not putting on a Nintendo console. It started on a Nintendo console. And so, stay tuned, stay tuned. More than likely, Doom 64 will be dropping on a Nintendo. Swiggity, swiggity, swig, swiggity, switch. All right, so look forward to that. It's pretty cool that the Switch is going to have every single Doom game ever made. Dope stuff. All right, next news item. And speaking of 64, when is Nintendo going to hook the homies up with Super Nintendo and Nintendo 64 virtual console games. I think it's coming, but we're impatient, Nintendo. You better give it to us sooner than later. We want better online features. Super Nintendo, Nintendo 64's 64 games would be perfect. Doom 64 is coming. We already got Turok 64. Come on, Nintendo. Mario 64. The 64 was so lit, man. Mario 64. Wave Race 64. Golden Eye 007. Diddy Kong Race. So many classic games on the 64. Star Wars Rogue Squadron? Bruh! Alright, next news item. <coughs> the Super Smash Brothers. Hero News continues to heat up. How much so? I can smell butterflies burning. All right, but it looks like we have more in the story of Hero coming to the Switch. The game has been, not the game, the hero has been data mined. That's right, before we talked about how Hero was discovered um, on a Japanese um, advertisement or something in a random place that it was announced that August 4th, according to a random Japanese advertisement. But now, bro, he's been data mined. A spirit event has been data mined for Hero coming to Smash. So, any day now, bro. Any day now, bro. Like I said, where there's smoke, there's fire. All right, next news item. This is dope, dope, dope. It looks like Fire Emblem is killing it on the Switch right now. Fire Emblem Three Houses has topped Amazon best-selling list as well as most stores are seeing empty shelves of the game being sold out. This is, I said this before the game launched. 
that this was going to be the best selling game in the series history in franchise history and it looks like it's happening easily the biggest game they've ever made the story so far has really wrapped me in game of thrones tied with harry potter i'm not a harry potter's fan but game of thrones is lit <laughs> really really like the game so far and i switched it up bro i said i was going golden deer bro i ended up going black eagles bro she mesmerized me with her eyes. <laughs> so we're going, we're going, uh, Black Eagles, Black Eagles, we're about to be lit. Fire Emblems, good to see that this game is selling great, bro. Nintendo has a gaming console that not just the hardware is selling, but the software is killing it too, bro. It's good to see software crushing it in sales and can't wait to see the npd numbers for fire emblem three houses it's going to be very very good even though it's coming out <coughs> at the end of july it's still going to be up there in sales um fire emblem three. now i have to say it's not a game for everybody it's more of a laid-back tactical strategy game i'm playing it primarily for the story but it's a dope well-made game bro what surprised me the most is every single dialogue is voice acted. Every NCP, bro. NPC. NPC. Every character I went up to, voice acting. A lot of time and effort went into this game. Because there's some dudes I could just randomly just walk right by. And I would have never known what they have to say, but everyone has something to say. That's pretty dope. <coughs> Just a quality, quality game. The game has lived up and even some ways surpassed my expectations. All right. Next news item, bro. Talking about Doom coming to the Switch. Doom Eternal. The new, their new multiplayer mode has been revealed at QuakeCon. And it's a twist to your traditional online multiplayer. It's going to be Slayers versus Demons, bro. And so they really switched it up. They already said that they're not going the traditional uh, multiplayer route. And true to form, it's been revealed. It looks interesting. looks dope. Personally, I would prefer your traditional classic um, team deathmatch and all that stuff. But hey, diversity. That's the spice of life. That's a spicy meatball. And so, definitely going to be picking this up. It launches on the Switch on November 22nd. Doom Eternal, boy. And this last news item really isn't that great for the Switch. Dragon Quest Builders 2. Now, the game looks dope. It has online multiplayer. Um, and so, I would have picked this game up if it didn't launch right around the time of Fire Emblem, bro. I'm just not going to have time to play it all i'm just gonna wait for dragon quest 11 to come out and play that but digital foundry did a frame rate analysis on the switch version and it wasn't that good bro now for the main campaign and that's where most dudes will spend most of their time they said the game runs right around 30 frames per second which is good but they said in some of the online modes where you're um entering the worlds of other players creations the frame rates drop below around 10 frames per second they said their lowest recorded frame rate um frame rate was seven frames per second that is horrible bro and that's why um we might get snuck into the nintendo switch <laughs> a <laughs> the nintendo switch Lite, and the revised switch um a revision on the 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 chip we might get better processors that's not guaranteed but it looks like nintendo might sneak in faster cock speeds to help to smooth out some of the frame rates in some of these games and to end this video speaking of nintendo switch lights bruh i'm giving away a nintendo switch light to a member a twitch sub um, YouTube member or Patreon sponsor, all three gets you into the OGC, Obi-Wan Plays Gaming Championships, weekly prize tournaments, a great Nintendo Switch gaming community, and in September, early September, giving away a Nintendo Switch Lite 
to a member of the OGC. All right, dudes, that's it for this video. What do you guys think about the Switch being doomed? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. Oh, thanks. Then, 10, go. We out, bro. Please!